Ban penki imbiang ya kata masa nak kebentar ban kentiu ya kerep so strawberry hapo kajalam ikhal ya. Haka kat arterik ya yang ketenat horticulture. Harengkat berketenat tourism kalas dang biang ban penlong ya ke strawberry festival arajar arpusau. Kaba arsengi dan ter haki lighter liquid district. Gibo kentup ya keribhoi district. Is kasi hills but west garo hills. Haka tamasa kabala sedang Haribhoi District, la penlong ya kena ketamasa haka senang sok liya kabala tip rukum ke Strawberry Village haka bau Vijay Kumar di IAS, Komisioner Skateri Ketenat Tourism, ulawan berpilih ya kena ketamasa kum ukong san. Haka jingga don lang ru uba o lengkoi rangbak senang ke sok liya, lembat kiwe kiwe ki hek opisar. Ya kena ketamasa Strawberry la penlong haka senang sok liya Haribhoi District, haka senang sentung ha East Kasi Hills, Bat haka senang dari Cigre jongka West Garo Hills. La ya teri lang ruk ban kentiu ya kena kata masa harengkat ke kenhun jongka Opus Production bat ka Meghalia Grassroot Music Project. Haka baki don shibun ke jing penbergian na duk ke jing yak kejat, ke jing yak cycle, ke jing yak lekai jongki kelung kena, ke jing yak lat ruk ban lekhek ya ki sok strawberry na ki farm haka ni ke senang. Bat ruk ke jing don jongki dukan di jing di, ki badi ya ki sok strawberry, ki wine, ki umso, bat ka bam beper beper. Haba keren kumukong san hadin ke jingwan ban jurep bat ban mat ya ke jing tiang bat jing bang jong uso strawberry na kawai ke strawberry farm. Uvi jay kumar di ulah penpau ke jing kemen ke makrau. Ban ya don bentah haka ni kata masa ban kentiu ya uso strawberry. Bat ban kentiu ya ke yuk kakot jong kinong rep ya uni uso hapok ke jelah mekhal ya. Bat haka ni ke senang sok liya kaba day ruk ke jing temu jong ke suar kar jelah. Ban ya ibiteng ya kum ke ni kata masa na kawai ke senam sya kawai pan. Ban kentiu ya kinong rep hapok ke jelah. Ula ong ruk baka jingga terilang hape deng ketenat horticulture bat ketenat tourism kan kenti ubaha ya kinong rep kibar rep ya shibun kimar rep kibalak ban yok ya kajing yok nong na kajing wan ya shim mentah jong kinong wan jengok kai perthai na keleng kiri bat kijela bapher bapher bat kajingga terilang jong kini ki artli ketenat terikam sorkar kan penmentoi syik ade ya kipat nong rep jong kene kejela. Ka jela mikhal ya ka dey ka jela ka bala yok ya ka jing kerku ka bak kerpang Na mar ka jing long jing man jok ka sun peneng ka ba itenat Ka jing sebok ka kendau ban rep ban riang Bat ka jing don jok kiksyat ki ba itenat Ka wan rak shibun ki kabu ya ki nong rep bat kito ki baterai Ha ki benta jok ka tenat tourism Ban kentiw ya ka yok ka kot bat ka ay kam ay jam Kum ta nak kalian ke tenat tourism ru kan ya ibiteng ban penlong ya kum kini kita masa. Kenang bagi nong wan jengok kai perthai kini yuk ban mat ya kajing itenat. Bat kajing bang jong kabam kadi kisok bapher bapher. Kiba mi nak kene kejela ong uvi jay kumar. So when we think of our state Meghalaya, we have, I think we have many opportunities but I think the two greatest opportunities that we have is tourism and high value horticulture. So I was discussing with Baos, he was saying Baos, the strawberry is much better than ginger because strawberry in two bags you can carry strawberry and you can get 50,000 rupees in your pocket. So ginger even if you carry one big bag of ginger, you will get less money because strawberry is a high value crop. So high value crops like strawberry uh, grow very easily in Meghalaya. We have a wonderful climatic conditions, excellent soil. Our farmers are hardworking, they want to take advantage of all this and they want to grow these crops. So, and when we sell these crops, we are able to distribute, whether it is, uh, whether it is strawberries, whether it is uh, flowers, whether it is other fruits like kiwis, whether it is, you know, even high value spices like our lacadon turmeric. So all these high value produce that we are capable of producing in our state thanks to our wonderful climate, thanks to our, uh, uh, as I said, the, 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 the soil and all the resources that we have, we can make more money. So we can earn more money and we can earn more money. The farmers can earn more money. The, people, the entrepreneurs can earn more money with by taking advantage of what we have, the natural resources, the natural endowments we have. The second great advantage we have is tourism which is, I think, Meghalaya, they're again blessed with good climate and uh, this, this green uh, geography with wonderful waterfalls and all. People would love to come to Meghalaya. So what we're trying to do through this strawberry festival is to integrate these two advantages we have. We have, we have tourism, we have the advantage of tourism, we have the advantage of high-value horticulture. So when we do a thing like high-value horticulture crop like strawberry, 
So we not only sell the strawberry, we not only do value addition of the strawberry, uh, you know, to kind of increase the income of the farmers. These kind of events should be held consistently. They should be held annually, and they should be held uh, in a predictable manner. So I see some tourists are there. So it's a wonderful thing that people, you know, from outside the state, outside the country, are coming for events like this. But they will come when we when they know in advance that next year this festival will happen. So I want to make a commitment here that we will do festivals like this. This festival, definitely the strawberry festival. Let us make it as an annual event, so that every March or every April, when the when the fields are in full bloom, when the when when the when the fields are in full production, when the strawberry production is at its peak, so we do a tourism event, so that not only do we do the farmers benefit from direct sale of strawberry, but they also benefit from tourists coming in. And other people benefit. We set up homestays here. We have a wonderful homestay scheme. So under that, I'm sure many people from the village are also taking advantage of the homestay scheme. So we are also building a beautiful homestay right there uh, on the top of the hill. So we are renovating that existing homestay. So by the time next year we do the festival, so we not only have to uh, strawberries, but we also have tourism on a large scale, so that. People buy the strawberries. People, uh, you know, buy the strawberry wine. People also stay in the village. People eat the food here. So that brings prosperity. So this is the story. A simple festival, a small festival that we are doing, will have a huge impact here across the state. And as uh, mentioned, we are doing this festival. This is a unique festival because it's not happening only in one village. While this is the main village, we are also doing it in two, three, or two other locations. So these locations are Simpu and uh, uh, you know in Garo Hills a place called Darichije. So as we move along, we want to expand the cultivation of crops like strawberry because previously we used to do five acres under strawberry cultivation. So today we are doing 25 acres. By next year we will do 100 acres under strawberry cultivation. So maybe if we are able to uh, you know uh, tap the market properly and if we are able to uh, process our strawberries and sell our strawberries well, we can increase the area up to 500 acres also because the, the the value of the strawberry, the way it is able to this crop is able to change the lives of the people is significant. <laughs> Untuk terter ini rap, aduh terter aduh muka agak lembut saja jadi sobri yang hampir bersenam mengalap pada diri sobri kalau jadi dapat kami nong bentuk bentuk. Tiap bagus muka, di penong ini sobri sebal muka senang berkiru rap, di mana jam senang berpin ini gue gue ru, kini si muka lang berap senang berkiru, kini kiu apa yang akan dan kesan ini kini bisa menjadi. Atau nong sobri muka ini laban penwan bunda cijing. Ki by produk mana? Ini cina sobri jam, ini cina sobri wan, ini cina jahit reter sobri, ini cina sinir met sobri entar terter. Ulang bab lapan puluh kami. Ya kesabaran ini cina entar sobri. Dia kelong ke eh ke bah? Ni lapan puluh kami pun jah. Tak ada orang petilor ini nore baru. Bahkan rap jenis sobri. Ya ke eh ke problem lagi jenis rap pulang tangguh sampai. Ranting material mai apa lah sebab setiap marang ni yang empat lapan puluh ini sembal jong. Mangi guna ki teknik kang persen balik oleh kamp dia yang tak kedau. Kau problem konsep ni ada itu kau tahu. Mangi mula banyak terai. Ngawar anda tu punya nafo himacang. Kau dua orang tu ini lolong arpo arpan terai. Tiga orang tu mula benda buat bantik itu kita. Ter, nafo kau dah ru kau dah nampak kerja tu. Nicha talk tu tek tek. Nicha bluff. Ter, tek tek kau orang dah mata ini rap benda don kau rap dua orang berarti umur bom tak pa. Kini orang rap itu nong nong tu. Saya kau ipar, ajun tu nak kolong pada wan kena kan natural committee sebab nukria, abah wan nukria tu ada ki arba naik rum pat biasa berkait, ma boleh ni apa tu sekon tak penting orang bah unbah ni apa tu berat pun tu tu kita boleh sekria, dari tak dahui apa seluruh ini orang baru kait pati dia, sembat tak berat sebab ini tak nak lecak orang cecut tu, ngalain mengas doro banyalam, cuci nuston semua tu. Jom operan itu pergi area bangalai cuma nongkong bandek interviews, kumno bandung, kumno band, ai to mungkin kumno bangalum, kumno kadrip itu baru kau jalan cuma hadian bangalayu akan dijengkram dalam permen, bangalai kelas sedang, tak bagi orang bangalai penjara, 